I do not like drawing out a calendar, so I cheated, printed it out, cut it to shape. I could add a little bit of washi tape at the top just to give it a little zhuzh. Why don't we do that? Why don't we add just a little bit of zhuzh? Because on this channel, we zhuzh. Hi everyone, this may be chaotic. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna start this off with that. <laughs> I, I am really trying hard to organize all of my stickers that I have. I mean, I have books and books and books and I have washi tape coming out of my ears. And for 2024, I am really trying to do a no spend, <laughs> which not gonna lie, I have washi tape in my Amazon cart. Someone stop me. Stop me now. <laughs> All right. So I am in my spiral notebook. I wanted to show you I am using a Carpe Diem sheet. Possibly I am using some cutouts. These are ephemera. They're fussy cut. You guys all know. If you are new here, I do not fussy cut. It is a pain in my patootie. I ordered these sticker books thinking they were all pre-cut and they are not. And you can see, oh, the amount of fussy cutting is a lot, a lot, a lot. And I'm not down with it. So I've got some that I've cut out. I don't know if we'll use them all, but they're there just in case. And then I have my Happy Planner classic sticker sheets that have a bunch of like redates and stuff. I've used a ton, every single washi tape I felt looked like the month of March. So let's get crack a lacking in my, oh, I've got two rulers too. Bada bing, uh, bada boom. A clear and then my ginormous. I'm not sure why I pulled out my scissors, but here they are. Here they are. Pens, let me move this out of the way. She can get a, a real feel for where we're at as far as like hoarding planner supplies. It's not not something I'm totally proud of. It's also not something I'm not very proud of, but it is what it is. In fact, I have another yellow somewhere. Oh, right here. I have a yellow and a green. So let me, let me just add those to the mixy mix of things. Scooch these back up where they belong. Ready? Are you ready? I am ready. Okay. Am I in screen? Nope, not even close. All right, let's, yikes. Let's do something here. Let's, yikes. Wes is going to be like, April, your job is to keep things in. Maybe we should start over. I don't know. I feel like that's good. Is that good? No, I feel like it's not good at all. Okay, that's pretty good. Let's do that. Oh, no. Let's do that. I feel like Wes is going to be like, let me tell you a story about that doesn't work for me. All right, so I've I've taken some scrapbook paper, laid it down in my notebook. I made a little tabby. Look at that little tab. Sure, sure, sure. And then I had some extra paper from one of my envelopes that I had created. So put that on there. My <laughs> diffuser is going crazy. So if you see this like drift of fog, it's it's just my diffuser. I've got Elevate and Lemon in there. Give me a, a little bit of boost. So obviously we're in March. I do not like drawing out a calendar, so I cheated, printed it out, cut it to shape. I could add a little bit of washi tape at the top just to give it a little zhuzh. Why don't we do that? Why don't we add just a little bit of zhuzh? Because on this channel, we zhuzh, right? There's a little bit of green. Is there another one? I like this one. I did go through a lot of my washi tape and pull the ones that I really haven't used for a long time and threw them in the stack, especially if they were green. Well, honestly, only if they were green. That's silly. I wouldn't pull any other color. So there we have it. Now down here and up here, I've got some extra room. So of course we can pop in there with additional washi tape. I like the idea of having kind of this organic floral feel to the layout. Oops. 
So I'm gonna try to continue that throughout the entire week. Month, week, month, probably week. I can't commit to a whole month in decorating because that's a lot. That is a lot. So I haven't quite figured out what I'm gonna do with these two spaces yet. I know, you're like, but April. Yeah, I know. It's like the dashboards that come in the planners. They're pretty, they're functional. They're just not functional for me. I've got a bunch of pens I can use on it. I can even use my white signal on it, but I just, I haven't decided yet. Also, I haven't decided what I'm gonna put in my monthly calendar yet. And you're like, April, come on, you're planning, you're filming. I realize this. You are, you are preaching to the choir, my friends. I am going to show you a new layout that I came up with. Are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? Is that a Taylor Swift song? I don't know. I don't know. It might be. It might not be. So let me go over here. I think it's four. Let me just double check. One, two, three, four. Yeah, it is four. Remember me talking about the... Um, oh, oh, that's not going to work. Let's move you over. Sorry. Hand in the air like I just don't care. All right. You know what? <laughs> what am I thinking here? I like pre-drew out some lines. Let me... You guys, this is the most unorganized I have been since 1996 I don't know what the the reasoning for 1996 is there really isn't I'm just making the year up but I haven't been this organized in a very long time a very long time if you are new here my name is April this is plan with April such a creative name and I have been planning gosh a very long time. Can we just say it's been a very long time? Do I have to say how long? Just a very long time. I've gone from Franklin Covey through Aaron Condren to, gosh, uh, Moxie Life. It's been, it's been six weeks since you looked at me. Nope, it's been a long time since I have been planning. And I think I went over too far, which is fitting. Do I go all the way down? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Dang it. Okay. Well, since this is the first time I've done this layout, we are going to be gracious and allow for mistakes. Oh, and I went all the way to the bottom again. Yeah, there's going to be mistakes on this one. It'll get better the more I do this layout, but because it's brand spanking new, I'm really not sure. I'm not clear on the instructions. So hang in there with me. I've got some notes at the bottom here that I've made. So yeah, this is this is awful, but it is what it is. I wonder if I can take my white signal. Let's just look. Let's just see. It's been. Okay, well this is working, right? If you don't already have a beverage, I recommend you go get one because this could be taking us a minute that you might, might need hydration and an extra dose of patience. Again, once I start doing this layout more often, it won't be, I am not even gonna try with the white pen on that one. I'll give you a little Drifty drift, bum, bum, bum. All right, flip you over. And then let's go this way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Who is that? Yeah, it's the count. One, two, three, four. Do you, so when you watch a plan with me, are you like, I really like watching April draw lines and set up the daily so that I know what she's doing. Actually, this is a weekly, so it's not even a daily. But do you do you like watching the process? Or are you more of a, yeah, just show me how you fill it in? Or is it just depending on what kind of mood you're in? Because that's me. 
it's dependent on what kind of mood I am in for the day. If you don't recognize this layout, and I don't blame you if you don't, this is actually the teacher layout inspired by the teacher layout. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. I know that's not how it goes. It's Monday, Monday. I know. Again, the more I do this layout, the better I will get knowing where to stop and start with my lines. For today, I am asking for patience and grace. Patience and grace. I am trying to line up my ruler with the bottom of the page so that I do get somewhat of a straight line. So there is that. And then I went in and said this was going to be Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Perfect. And then across the top, I was trying to think of six different categories. Now, I can tell you that is going to be a little tricky 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 right so let me let me pop down some washi what do I want to use I've got all this washi tape you guys let's do this one. Oh goodness sorry sorry there perthunkle oh that did not do what I wished for it to oh my gosh okay we're gonna we're gonna think happy thoughts, happy washy thoughts. There we go. There we go. A happy little washy. We're gonna go in here. We're just gonna lay it. I'm gonna lay it a little long. Lay it a little long. Just grab my palette knife. Chop it like a quarter wood. No, that's not a thing. It's not. It's not a thing. Okay, and then let's do it on the other side. I was gonna say that's what she said, but why would she say that? That doesn't make any sense. That doesn't make any sense at all. Okay, that is really super faint. <laughs> super faint, super faint, she's super faint. Gosh. I just thought about it. Wes is gonna be edi editing this video and he's gonna be like, wow, that's a really, really crazy moment. Sorry, babe. So sorry. I was gonna add a little. It's <laughs> gonna add a little pop of green. Let's try this. I'm gonna go slow. I'm not usually a patient individual, but we're gonna try because I have a vision in my head. Anyway, Wes is doing all of the editing of the videos and designing the thumbnails. So. If you are a brand new subscriber, and that is why, if the thumbnail brought you in and you were like, yes, oh, I almost went too fast. Hold on. Quit talking, April. Concentrate. Concentrate. That's not a song. I just made it up. Sounded like, I don't know, Weird Al Yankovic, maybe. Concentrate. A country western weird, weird Al? Sure. Okay. So that is that on that. So down here, if you can see this, I've got weather, film, meals. So let's go at the top. I'm gonna grab my, do, 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 what am I gonna grab? Let's grab the, I don't know how to say that, but that's what it is, okay? Fair enough, don't know how to say it. Here we go. So we're gonna put in Weather, film, meals. Actually, I'm just going to put in meal. Perfect. And then we're going to flip, 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 flip. We're going to do chores. Oh my gosh. So again, my husband is editing these and he's going to watch the chores I put down and he's going to laugh to himself. He's going to be like, yeah, she's not doing that. I won't be surprised if he edits something in this video to say she is a clutter bug and never cleans up after herself. And it's true. If he doesn't do that, I'm just going to just going to say it's true. It's 100% true. 
Okay, so let's flip back over here. So I've got chores, spending, appointments, meals, film, weather. Let me see a Tootsie Roll. I'm going to go in here. I don't know why there is goobers on this, but this is the Crayola Super Tip. Crayola Super Tip. And because we're doing the month of March, this is why I'm using all the greens. Green is probably my favorite color next to, next to yellow. So let's do an M for Monday, a T for Tuesday, a W for you know what, a T for you know what, an F <laughs> for Friday, and then a Saturday and a Sunday. Look how nice that looks. And I think I'm gonna grab, should I do my 07 Pilot or should I go in with my Paper Mate? I haven't used my Paper Mates in a minute, so let's use those. What is our date gonna be the first week? Let's flip back to our little calendar, take a look. The only thing I will tell you, if you are a Monday starter, like in your weeklies and you have Sunday start calendars, be warned because your first day is gonna be the fourth, not the third. It is so confusing. And when I first started planning, I was a Sunday to Saturday. And then I got a planner that had the weekend combined. And I'm like, oh, it was the most magical thing. So when I plan for the most part, unless I'm meal planning, I start on Monday. My meal plans start on Sunday because Sunday is the start of my week for meal planning because I do all my meal prepping on Sunday. Now I forgot the date. Hold on. Monday the 4th. Tuesday the 5th, 6th, 7th, oh, what did I do there? That took up three, eight, nine, ten. I tell ya, I'm gonna make this a little, a little juicier, a little bold, M more, more substance. Perfect. Put that back away, put it away, put it away, put it away now. I am gonna outline my Crayolas. Ready? Toot, 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 toot. Super easy, but it is going to make it look that much more. Like if you're going for more, yes. Extra, yes. Here we are. Sign us up. Am I right? How many of you plan in a spiral notebook? Comment down below. I want to know. And hit that like button if so far you're getting some ideas that you didn't really have before. Because I like that. I like coming up with new things that people are like, okay, all right, I wouldn't have thought about that before. I wouldn't have realized that you could X, Y, or Z. I didn't realize you could take a white Signo pen and correct your silly lines on your notebook. Yes, you can and no one's gonna know. They're gonna know. They're not gonna know. So, I mean, if they're looking that closely at your notebook, my question is, why are they looking that closely at your notebook? Unless you're like me and you're filming for YouTube, if someone's that close to your notebook, yowzers. Like, gives me a Scooby-Doo moment. Like, we would've been fine if those darn kids wouldn't have been staring at my lines on my planner. I know, dating myself. Dating? No, aging. Whichever. Whichever. All right, I'm just going to do this while I'm sitting here and, and chatting with you. If you are a, a spiral notebook planner, tell me, have you ever tried this layout? And if you have, did you stick with it? If you didn't stick with it, why didn't you stick with it? Did it just not work after a while? I can see that. All right, let's hop in here with, now I can take these guys out. And I have to be careful because I want to reuse them again. Do I got these little page markers off AliExpress and they are sticky. Like I would say if you were going to use these, like put them on your hand first. You know, like you do like makeup tape like put them on the back of your hand first and like get some of the sticky off because they are brutal brutal okay I have some thicker washi but it is not it is transparent 
So I'm going to white out. Let me do it this way. I'm actually going to take my white out and just go down these lines. I know it's extra. I know. But here's the thing. We're not spending $85 on a planner. We are in our spiral notebook. So if we want to do a little bit extra with white out, do a little bit extra with white out. Am I right? Like we are saving so much money being in a gorgeous spiral planner than if we, you know, went and purchased a planner. Granted, I personally have done that. And while I don't want to say that I regret it because I don't, I've had some very, very beautiful planners in my lifetime. When it comes to 2024, it is a budgeting year. I'm not even going to pretend like it's not. This economy is crazy. And I don't, I don't know. It's kind of weird. It is, it is what it is, right? So I'm trying to use up what I have. I definitely have plenty to use up. So if I can make it happen, I don't mind it a bit. But I do want to add in some of this ephemera that I have. Because again, trying to use all of the things, right? Trying to use all the things. Let's pop one down there. Perfect. What can we do over here? Kiss me, I'm Irish. I'm not. I'm kissable. I'm just not Irish. Are you Irish? Comment down below. Comment down below if you are Irish. Oh, I need to put down something this month for, I think, my favorite. Oh, my favorite restaurant is over at the coast, and it's Nana's. Nan's? Nana's? You're like, April, it's your favorite. Why don't you know the name? Because I'm reading it on the side of my head, and I can't remember if it has an N-A-S or just an N-A. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They also have really good beer, which could be part of the reason I don't remember the name. Just a saying. Okay, so let's go in here. I want to do a little bit more decorating. I'm feeling like we need just a little bit more, a little bit more, right? So let's pop in here. I have been doing cuts, so. Um, let's go in here. I'm going to put this down here. I like this color combination with the yellow and the green. That feels a very pot of gold for me. That feels very, very clever. Do I want another one in here? I'll go offset. There's that. And there's that. Perfect. I also have, so I know I'm going to be filming and I know I'm going to be doing weather and I know these three columns are going to be pretty, pretty full. However, I also know that I have some really cute stickers that I fussy cutted. And you know me, if I'm going to take the time to fussy cut, I'm going to take the time to put it in my planner because I am not a big fussy cutter. So over here, I'm going to put this down for filming. I know it's a regular camera, but you know, don't come at me. Don't come at me. Da -na 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 -na. And then I have, okay, so on Monday, I know, let's do this guy because I know I'll be doing my envelope filming this weekend. Oh, is, no, that is upside April. Oh, come on. Oh. Here we go. We're going to we're going to peel it off. It's going to come off nicely. We're manifesting this to come off nicely. Perfect. All right, much better. That looks like an envelope now instead of just, you know, me being unorganized. And then the great thing about these stickers is that they can be written over. Oh, you know what? I cut this out and it had this weird like ball and I didn't like the ball, but I thought, oh, I can probably incorporate it. Nope. 
I am not interested in incorporating whatever that is. It's almost like a fingerprint yarn ball. And yeah, I don't think that's a real thing either, but that to me is what it looks like. Can I tear it? You guys are getting a lot of singing today. How do you feel about that? Wow. <laughs> Good thing I aged out of American Idol. Just saying. Just saying. Just hear those sleigh bells jingling. Yep, that's where we are. Almost to March, and I'm still singing Christmas tunes. It's, yeah. It's gonna be me. Oh, did I not wipe that one out? Look at that. Did I get to chatting and then like skip it? Were you guys like, April, go back. Sorry, I didn't hear you. Sorry, I did not hear you. I'm going to let that one go to the top and that one end right there. Yay. Okay. Using this washi tape that we have. For a second, that one looked much smaller than the other. I'm just gonna grab this washi and I'm gonna put it right here because I really, oh, no, those are limes. Just because they're green doesn't mean they fit. What was that? Let's try some glitter. Ooh, I don't know how well this is gonna stick. We're gonna try it, but it feels, mm-mm, no, look, peels right off. Nope, not going to work. I know I don't have any appointments on Saturday and Sunday, so I am gonna pop some stickers down here. I don't know why I kept saying it that way. Y'all, what is that? That's not how I talk. Ooh, let's do her like she's going on vacation because who couldn't use a vacation right now? Raise your hand, comment down below, hit the like button, whatever you have to do to tell me that you are ready for a vacation. Cause you know what? I'm there. I've been ready for a vacation. Whew, since my last vacation. I am really liking this green layout, even though I have yet to figure out what the heck I'm gonna put in here for a plan. <laughs> Perfect, little world traveler she is. Like that, I'm gonna grab this skinny washi here. We're gonna put it down right here. Just add a little more, a little more something, something to this layout, cause why not? I'm not gonna go over her feet though. I'm gonna leave her feet open. Leave the feet. Is there anything here that we could utilize? I really like these, but I don't know, like now that I've torn it off, I don't know where I would use it. Chores, sure, Sunday I'm not doing a whole lot of chores. I mean, let's be honest, Wes does 99% of the chores. Okay, let's look in the Happy Planner because I feel like this, well, no, that side of the board's looking good too. Is there anything in here? Oh, those are cute. Well, those are really cute. Let's grab one of these. And let's put, do I want to do a spending? Sure. Sure, why not? Let's just slap that down on there. That's kind of fun. And then what else do we have? Do we have any birthdays? I don't think so. I don't think I have. Ooh, there's another. There's another good green. Where'd it go? There it is. I'm like, where in the world is Carmen San Diego? Do I want to combine Saturday and Sunday chores? Why not? Perfect. You guys, I'm really liking how this comes, this is coming together. Mm-hmm. 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 Yeah, I'm really liking this a lot. However, my cheat sheet with my meals on it is missing. So hold on. Don't go anywhere, please. Don't run off. Don't, don't run off. Okay, I got it. I got it gonna say I know I have meals planned out so for meals this column here let's go in here let me move some of this out of the way so you can see what in the world I'm doing is there anything with avocado there's not okay well I'm putting an avocado down anyway because 
It's meals. It is meals. Let's go in here with the Pilot G210. It is my favorite pen. Do, do, do. G Pilot G210. Monday, we're going to do cabbage roll soup. I haven't even been looking to see if I am like in camera, so I hope I am. Cabbage roll soup. If you are interested in 21 recipes for the month of March, click down below. I have my meal planning list. Also, midweek meal planning is every Wednesday, so you can check out all of my meal plans, including this one that I'm writing down, so you'll get a sneak peek. This one is going to be Tuscan shrimp. Mmm. Mm-hmm. So good. I wish I had a shrimp sticker. <laughs> I may look and put it in there later. Mushroom stroganoff. If you guys are looking for a meatless Monday, or I just say meatless Monday because it sounds cool. Mushroom stroganoff instead of beef stroganoff is so good. I would say it's probably one of our very favorite meals. You still use the egg noodles. You still use everything. But in place of the, the beef, use mushrooms. And you can use portobello mushrooms. You can use uh, button mushrooms. You can use brown mushrooms. You can use any mushrooms you want or a combination of all of them. Orange glazed salmon. Yes, please. And I will probably, depending on what prices are in the store, because that does really kind of mediate, mitigate, mitigate, whatever that word is, how much I'm gonna spend. I may do frozen broccoli, I may do fresh broccoli, I may do fresh asparagus, I may do fresh, oh, you know what would be good with this? An orange glazed salmon with a ginger baked carrot. Ooh, that would be yummy. That would be really good. And then Friday, I am gonna make a broccoli ramen. And you're like, what? Yes, I'm serious. If you have time on Wednesdays, tune into my midweek meal plan. It is so good. And for the month of March, it's 28 recipes. For Saturday, it'll be leftovers, leftovers. And then Sunday is meal prep day, where I spend a lot of time in my kitchen, chopping, cutting, puring, doing all the things. And so I snack the whole time, the whole time. All right, let's go back. Chores. Ew, I don't want to write down chores. Okay, it's going to be easy. I don't do a whole lot of chores. Let me preface that with I work a nine-hour workday between drive times. Like, you know, so my, my chore time is either early in the morning or late at night, and it just depends on my filming schedule. So Monday, I'm going to say tidy bathroom. Okay. I'm just going to put all my makeup away, make sure my curling iron's cooled off, put it in the drawer, throw my blow dryer back in there. I'm going to tidy the bathroom. Tuesday. Oh, what do I want to do on Tuesday? Oh, I am going to, I'm going to commit to this and Wes is going to see this and be like, she's not going to commit to this. You guys, he'll, he seriously, he does all the cleaning. Um, let me put down here, I want to do bedding on the weekend for sure. So I'll put bedding in there. We'll end up doing that together, but bedding. Bedding's a good, bedding's a good bet. Let me say I will, ooh, let's do, <laughs> let's do Friday. Unclutter the kitchen table. I am a clutter bug. Like anytime I come home from work, I just drop and go. So uh, ooh, that's another good one. Put away shoes. I'm going to cough. <coughs> Put away shoes. Because as soon as I get home, I just drop my shoes at the door and that's, that's where they go. Clean out car. Oh, I don't know that I want to do that. Honestly, it is, it is bad. It is so bad. You know what? I'm going to take Tuesday off because... That's a lot. That's a lot. I know. And you're looking over this list and you're like, holy cow, what does Wes do? Everything else. Cleaning the kitchen, 
Uh, I make dinner most of the time, but if it's like in the fridge ready, he'll totally make it. Expenditures, I don't have any this week. I don't have any appointments either. So, hey, we've made it. You guys, this is the week. Oh, except for the weather. I will fill that in later because I'm not sure I have my iPad is like being ornery. Totally ornery. So let me make sure I've got you guys in view. I don't. It's so large. Large and in charge. There you go. Let me know down below what you think. Let me know if you're going to subscribe to the meal plan, midweek meal plan. That's a lot of fun. Comment down below. I'll meet you there. And then, yeah, let me know what you think of this layout. It is, it is very much like the teacher planner layout. It's just changed a tiny bit. So I hope you have the very best week. And yeah, I love you. Thanks for being here. Bye, everyone.